Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics, and we're going to look back at Kiwi. So last time we learned my app how to work with box layouts. So now we're going to be learning about um, Kiwi buttons. Oops, didn't grab that. Kiwi buttons next. So all right, this is why it's so important we're hitting that subscribe button and the notification bell. So all right, that was box layout with labels. So now let's go ahead and jump on this. Let's go ahead and delete that. And we've seen buttons in other languages. And we're just going to okay, save, rerun this. And it literally, now same rules apply. It's going to split starting on, um, on the left, going horizontally to the right. So there we go. And that's what happens when we click a button. And Kiwi takes care of all of this for us. So now, now let's put some orientation on this. We want it to go top to bottom. One, two, three, four. Orientation. Vertical. Okay, spelled it right. All right, save. Run. And boom. Okay, great. So now, ha ha ha. Let's say, well, let's split this and put a button and then put a label on our button. All right, so boom. Here we go. Box layout. One, two, three, four. Label, two, three, four, text, start, save, python.my app.py. So here we go. Okay. Now, now we're going to see, close that. Now we're going to see that we can put a label on our button and it's literally just like this save that all right run this call it boom so now we have these side by side so very soon next time we are going to actually have this start doing something and we're going to be working on the python kiwi side not with the kiwi language because we're learning how to kiwi language does is is all the visual python with the kiwi language is going to do all the logic so next time we're going to learn how to hook these two up and do something to it so all right guys as always, please drop any comments, questions, or any video requests below, and I'll get right to them. And as super always, thanks for watching. Stay tuned, and we'll see you next time. Bye, guys.